Hey guys, Crystal Page Sky, and it's been an hour and five minutes already, and I'm saving because that's a really smart idea. And I totally forgot that my name was Nevi on this. Um, yeah, and so what was I gonna talk about? I was gonna say something. Oh, let's go back here. Oh yes, yes. All right. So you know how Caden was all like, Shepard, I'm worried about you. Blah 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 blah. And then I'm like, be quiet. A hole. I don't know what just happened. Um, uh, I am not going to be. Oh gosh, here he is again. Um, I'm not gonna have a relationship with him. Just letting you know, cause Liara is so much cooler. Oh no, spoilers. Oh, I didn't mean to say her name. Um, some other character who comes in later. That's gonna be. Commander, I'm glad to see love, you're okay. Losing Jenkins person. was hard on the crew and. I'm glad we didn't lose you too. Oh gosh, stop flirting with me. Soldiers die! Things were How pretty rough down there. Yeah, you never get used to seeing dead civilians. Doesn't seem right somehow. But at least you stop Saren from wiping out the whole colony. The mission failed! Okay, yeah, um, I'm going to be. An another thing is, I'm going to be answering these like I would answer them in if it was me. Um, most of the renegade options, which are the ones down here, um, which I'll explain later, um, I'm not really a renegade person, so I'm gonna be switching kind of between these two, and, but sometimes I will say these because that's something that I would say in that situation, but, I um, have you helped. You. We're Marines. Oh, Lord. We stick together, and I'm just sorry that we lost Jenkins. Yeah, I wish I could have done something to save him. I was there. You did the voice actress right. for her is so amazing. Luck. It's been a hell of a shakedown, Cruz. Our first mission Wait a second. one Spectre killing another. The Citadel Council's not going to be happy about that. Probably use it to lever more concessions out of the Alliance. I think the person who plays the voice of Commander Shepard also plays the voice of Samus and other M. <gasps> I think. I'm nerding out now. Okay, okay, what? Uh, it seems like you're the situation. <clears throat> you a career man? Yeah, a lot of bionics. Career are. man. We're unrestricted, but we sure don't go undocumented. May as well get a paycheck for it. Besides my father. That son, hair. I made him proud when I enlisted. Eventually. But is that why you're here? Because of your family? I don't we'll want talk you to another know. time. Make sure you're good to go for this meeting with the ambassador. Aye, aye, ma'am. Yeah, just no. Stay away from me. Paragon plus two. Oh, so happy. Okay. Um, which way am I going again? This way. Oh lord, what just happened? Elevator. Let's go in the elevator. Let's go, guys. Let's go, elevator. Oh, I can't move. Oh lord, this is the slowest elevator I've ever been on in my entire life. Oh god. But the elevators are the loading screens. Think, so. Oh lord. I think. Or is that a Mass Effect 2? Whoa, Norman. Bring the prison to our evening squad. Okay. Oh, green, green. Hey, Commander. Hey, what's up, dude? Looking for some extra supplies before you head out? What have you got? Whatever you want. Armor, weapons, mods. It's not standard Alliance issue, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. Ooh. Well, as long as you don't mind paying for it. Why should I pay you for my weapons and armor? My stuff doesn't come from the Alliance. I have to purchase it myself, and it's not cheap. Hell, the licenses alone have set me back more than I'd like. But no licenses, no goods. Without the goods, I'm out of a job. Let's see what you've got. Show me. You bet, Commander. Um, how much money do I have? Oh. Okay. I can't wear that. Because it's heavy, right? Um, the Scorpion 5? I mean... Oh lord, how did I miss the four? Scorpion four. 
I already have a scorpion, so I'm cool. Oh god, these are all really expensive, so... Oh, I can upgrade my grenade. Oh, well, let's just do that. Okay. Oh! I don't know half this stuff. I don't know if it's gonna help me or not help me. Oh, okay. Okay, thanks dude. Bye. What's down here? Let's go explore. We're gonna go explore. Oh lord. Um, I'm gonna get out of here. I should go do what I was asked to do, but I can't remember the way to get there. Ooh, I have shiny, like, backstrappy thingies. Like, uh, what are they called? They kind of look like suspenders, but they're not. Like, from the back, they look like suspenders, but then the, from the front, you're like, I don't even know what those are. They look like, like she's wearing a backpack, but there's no backpack. Like, the backpack is just this Y thing on the back, which makes no sense. Hey, wait a second, what happened to my awesome armor? Hey. I wish I could jump. I mean, I'm the most exciting person in elevators. Like, I seriously do the weirdest stuff in elevators. Like, no joke. I do weird stuff. Like, I jump up and down. I mess with the acoustics. Well, kind of. Um, I'm still going the wrong way. Okay, so I'm guessing a lot of this Let's Play is going to be me being lost. Dr. Chakwas, where are you, Dr. Chakwas? Cause I like, oh, I got a locker. Hey, it's my locker. I don't know. I don't really want those back. Oh, I'll just take them all, sure. Okay. Oh lord. Yes, Commander. Hey, Dr. Chakwas. Is there Chakwas. something you need? Goodbye. How did you Personal end up serving questions. on an Alliance ship? I enlisted right out of med school. Earth always seemed boring to me. Too safe, too <laughs> secure. I think oh, the I'm with you there, Dr. Chakwas. Adventure. I wanted to travel the stars, tending the wounds of tough soldiers with piercing eyes and sensitive souls. <laughs> Turns out military life isn't quite as romantic as I'd imagined. But humanity needs the Alliance if we want to keep expanding through the Traverse. And the Alliance always needs good doctors. So I stayed on to do my part. Ever think you made the wrong choice? Sometimes I think about opening a private practice back on Earth. Or maybe taking a that position at one of the new med centers out in the colonies. But there's something special about working on soldiers. If I left the Alliance now, I'd feel like I was abandoning them. Let's what do you know about, about Captain, Captain Anderson? Anderson? I've served with him for a few tours now. He knows when to let things slide and when to crack the whip. The crew knows he's seen pretty much anything they'll ever run into. And he cares about the people under his command. How well do you know the lieutenant? I'd never worked with him before this mission. But he has an impressive service record. Over a dozen special commendations. Tends to keep to himself, though. Maybe because of the headaches. It's not easy being an L2. What does that have to do with it? Well, most biotics now use the L3 implants. Lieutenant Alenko was wired with the old L2 configuration. Sometimes there are complications. What kind of complications? What is going on? Is he like a mental robot? disabilities, insanity, crippling physical pain. <laughs> it's a long list of horrific side effects. Hayden's lucky. He just gets migraines. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> oh, we've already. I should go. Goodbye. Goodbye, Commander. That's the way I talk to people normally. I'm always like, I should go. Bye. It was crack a lack in. Hey, you guys gotta tell me where I need to go because I'm lost. Tell me, please. I'm a commander on my ship, and I have no idea where I'm even supposed to go. Hey, Ashley. I'm you glad you're okay, Commander. Here. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. Soldiers Jenkins die. was a valuable part of this crew. Part of me feels guilty over what happened. If Jenkins was still alive, I might not be here. You're Soldiers a good soldier die. Owned. You belong <sighs> in the Normandy. How many times Thanks, have I seen commander. that option? That means a lot for me. I've never met anyone who was awarded the Star of Terra. Uh, wait. The Star of Terra? I'm cool. 
There's nothing special about you, Williams. Anyone would have done the same. Held off an entire enemy platoon? Alone? With all due respect, Commander, I think you've got somebody watching over you. Things were pretty oh, rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before. Comes with being a Marine. But to see my whole unit wiped out. I and don't you really never like get used teeth. to seeing dead civilians. Ooh. But things would have been a lot worse if you hadn't have shown up. We couldn't have done it without you, Williams. Thanks, Commander. I have to admit, I was a little worried about being assigned to the Normandy. It's nice when someone makes you feel welcome. Don't I disappoint think you're gonna me. You're going to fit in here just fine, Williams. Thanks, Commander. Because we're all weirdos. Oh, I got more Paragon. Yay! That means I'm a good person. Yay, it means I'm a happy, good person. Oh, this is like the place to chill. Hey, Captain Anderson, I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. Go Can speak you tell to Joker me? when you're ready. Tell him to bring the Normandy. Oh, gosh. I am ready. I just can't find Joker. Oh, this is sad. I should always know where Joker is because he's my favorite character. Oh, Lord. Don't tell me he's up here. Door control. Let's go. Open up. Hey, what's up, dude? Oh, I like your eye patch thingy. It's cool. I want it. Can I have it? What the heck? Oh, it's just a whole bunch of letters at the top. Oh, Lord, how many people does it take to drive this thing? Can I drive? I'll be right here. Actually, um, Joker? Can, can I, can I, like, sit, like, right here? Like, right here. Cool. No, just kidding. Sorry, I love Joker because he's played by Seth Green, and I Good timing, Joker. Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. Oh, this thing again. Unrendered. I think. Why are there clouds in space? Oh my god, flower. Look at the size of that ship. The Ascension. Flagship of the city. Flower! Well, size isn't everything. Why so touchy, Joe? <laughs> I'm just saying you need firepower, too. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side, then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring oh lord, it seems like it would take a lot longer Roger to do that, like, considering how many, how huge it is and how many, uh, ships there are just floating around. It seems like it would take, like, a lot of hours, many hours to land, you know, to get clearance to land instead of just, like, 30 seconds. Talking over the epic music, I shouldn't. I don't know why I made that noise, it's just tempting. I'm having flashbacks to the second Star Wars movie. This is an outrage! Second one, that the was... Council would step oh, in if Lord. the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Saren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter, I demand action! You don't get to make I'm demands cool. of a council ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Saren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Captain Anderson. I like this I see guy, you he's brought cool. Half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime. In case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate. They okay, are. you're not cool anymore. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. Seren's a threat to truth. every human colony out there. <coughs> if they don't stop him, I will. Oh, I'm sick right Settle now. down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. 
Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not hers. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. You're done saving. Um, important for active mission, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Hmm. The more I look at this shepherd that I've created, the more I realize she really doesn't look anything like me. I tried to make her look like me, but just didn't, just didn't go down, didn't go down. The red hair was a lot, like, my hair is kind of auburny. It's like dark blonde auburny. And it's not red. Oh, what's this? Ah, uh, okay. Oh, what, what the? Oh. I wanted to hack into the. Caden, what are you doing? Yeah, sure. Okay. Well, they built themselves quite the lake. Wonder if anyone ever. I like you. Okay, bye guys. Oh, guess I gotta go this way. Open sesame. Hmm. Uh, that's not the way I'm supposed to go. I don't think. Okay, so this is where it can starts being completely blind. Because I, this is where I stopped past the high point. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! The Asari. I'm like such a nerd the for the Asari race. The human ambassadors up the stairs, first room on the right. You know who I am. Yeah. Yes, I receive reports on all newly arrived dignitaries and notable people. What's your name? Personal question. What do you do here? My name is Sephiria. I'm the administrative assistant for the embassy. I like it. You seem to be distracted. The embassies are the hub of all Citadel politics. <laughs> when you represent trillions of citizens, it tends to get a little busy. What's your name? What do oh, you do here? Oh, shoot, shoot. My name is Sephiria. I'm the administrative assistant oh. for the embassies. I should be going now. Have a pleasant day. I should be going now. Is Wait, there something else Sephiria. I can help you with, Commander? What is Location. this place? This is the Presidium. More specifically, you are at the Citadel Embassies. If you have more questions, please access Savina. What's that? Oh, Avina is the virtual guide for the Citadel. Feel free to access the terminal yourself. I should be going now. <coughs> have a pleasant okay, day. Okay, I'll go find Avina. Bye, Sephiria. Are you flirting with this girl? Well, that's okay. Oh lord. Hey Avina. And What's welcome up? to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. Are you what real? Does that mean? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence, programmed to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. Give me the tour. Sounds interesting. You are standing at Presidium Tourism Terminal 1. On either side of this lobby are the embassies of the various Citadel races, along with CSEC headquarters. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel I'm having tower, flashbacks to Cortana from Halo. To discuss matters of interstellar importance. Oh, uh, shoot. I should end off the part. Because there's a lot to talk about here. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next part. Okay, sorry. That's a bad way to end. I'll see you guys later.